You Can Count On continues with Glenn Marini's Sports Report. There should be no Michael Buffer tonight. No, let's get ready to rumble. After the pregame altercation in Game 2 over the weekend, the Comets Eagle Series back in Fort Wayne tied at one game apiece. Tonight, we're talking Game 3 of the Western Conference Finals, and News Channel 15's Andy McDonald joins us live from Memorial Coliseum with more on your Game 3. Andy. Hey, thank you, Glenn. It's the biggest game of the year, and while we have some big news, ECHL MVP Sean Sidlowski, he's a scratch from the game tonight in Game 3, and joined by Comets head coach Gary Graham. What went into that decision to, to scratch Sidlowski tonight? Well, it wasn't a tough one. You know, he's been really laboring. Uh, he didn't play much at all in the third period if the fans watched uh, Game 2, and uh, even in Game 1, he was really struggling. I think as the, as the season's gone on, he's, he's wore down some. Uh, I'm not going to get into specifics on the injury, but um, uh, something was done today with the docs. Hopefully, it'll release some of the pain he's going through and um, you never know maybe you could get in this weekend he's not the only guy out tonight obviously the pregame scuffle between you and Colorado what is the message from the ECHL and how it relates to tonight well, they're not too happy about it, clearly. Um, they hammered uh, down uh, quite a bit of suspensions on the guys. Um, a lot of fines handed out, organizational fines, coaching fines. So um, I think things will kind of settle down a little bit. I think um, it's going to be physical still. I expect physical play, but it'll be more in between the whistles. How, do, how does that affect your team without Sadowski, without Daniel Maggio, who's suspended, without Dennis Kropchenko? How does your team kind of bounce back to fill those goal holes? Well, don't forget about Martino and yeah. Hodgman and uh, all the other guys. Uh, that's the way the series, that's where the season's been all year. So it's been an X man up uh, the entire season. I've never been around a team that's dealt with more injuries. Uh, but that's what's been great and neat about watching this team this year is they just keep, uh, uh, they've been re very resilient. So uh, I think that's the word to use. So, um, you know, we're excited to get Hauser back in that. Hauser will start tonight. So it'll be exciting to see him get back in there. Um, and again, it's going to be a big test. I expect Colorado's best game tonight. All right. Thank you, Coach. Good luck. Obviously, Michael Hauser will start in net for the comments. The puck drops here against the Colorado Eagles in game three at 730. Of course, we'll have highlights and reaction after the game. Glenn, back to you.